Jumpkin pool over here in Porterville. I just did a video. It didn't go through, so it was too long or something. I don't know. So I'm out here working on these. This armature here. And these things are kind of fun to get out, but I got it out. They they go in here like this, and then they they fit in there like that, and then they actually turn to get them out that lip. They lock into the shaft. I got a bunch of these loose. And I got some more. This is the armature here. I got some transfers, transformers getting ready. So I'll be stripping them down. I just wanted to do a quick video. Hope everybody had a Merry Christmas. And getting to get some 2019 or 2018. I'm not sure how that taxes works. Anyway, we got a bunch of taxes to pay. So this is a big electric motor I was going to tear apart. And this end is kind of inside, so cut the other end like that. And that's pretty much wire and cardboard. There's like a little oil on there, so that goes in with some cardboard and stuff stoked inside of it and get it to about 400 degrees. And You can re literally pretty much flip it over and pull them wires out with your hands. Sometimes you might need pliers. But if it gets good and hot, you can just try to take a few at a time, not too awful many. And it'll get easier as you go. There's the ends that come off of it. They got brass in the end of them, so that's got to be taken out, and then that'll be cast. Not motor cast. It's a, I think it's a different rate. And then these been cut around the edge here. And the same with these. You get these good and hot. And they'll, they'll, uh, you can pull them from this end a couple at a time, stick with one area. It might have to pretty much straighten the ones down here as you go. But you get them really good and hot, throw them in a boiler or a wood burner or something like that, and they'll come, I wouldn't say in the house or anything, but they'll come, uh, come out fairly easy. And you want to use this skinny wheel I pretty much wore this one out but it was half shot when I started so got a little bit of going on here beautiful day out today I think it's about 40 I think it's actually supposed to be cooler than that but it feels like about 40 so I just thought we'd do a quick video or I did these are a little tricky when you first get them started but yeah, I like to cut these before I try heating it because they're kind of bent. When if you heat them, they get lose some of the temper. So if you cut it first and then heat it, it's a lot easier. At least that's the way I've always done it. So I guess I'll make this one a short one and go in and have some lunch and some coffee. We're waiting on a guy who's supposed to be giving us a call to come over and buy our tractor at the old building, maybe. So we'll see if he's a go or not. We wanted to go over there sometime today in the afternoon, so maybe I'll do a video over there too. This is Junk and Pool in Porterville. Playing around with electric motors today. Hope everybody has a great day and go find some junk. Goodbye.